Well, guys, as you can see, Rusty is getting a little bit of a facelift. <laughs> uh, his grill is off front bumper and all of the chrome. Wow. There is bits and pieces of it here and there. And like I've shown you in the other videos, still going to retain Rusty's character. But inside, completely painted and redone and protected from all further rust at all. I don't know if it's you can really see, but that's an, um, an oil rub bronze rust-oleum paint with the Eastwood rust encapsulator underneath it. So there's it's not going to rust from the backside now. So uh, And then this is an example. So this is what it'll look like on the outside. I'm going to actually kind of use some oil and stuff and kind of polish this rough metal out. And then this one is the chrome side. And then on the back side of it, which no one will ever really see unless they get under the car, but will be this beautiful um, oil rub bronze metallic underneath on the back side. So all of these will have that oil rub bronze behind them. And then the original version, here's the special little uh, bumperettes that sit out front. And then I will end up getting evapor rust on the inside of those. So yeah, so... Uh, Here's one of the pieces that will be dipped in evaporust, and you'll see what it looks like when it's all done. There we go. All the chrome is off of the front. Here's the grill. Now I can finally detail the grill. I couldn't get into all the places to actually detail it because all the places that really have rust and, and are pitted, you can see I used uh, steel wool on these pieces here. It looks nice and pretty and shiny here, and then it gets dull as it gets down here. So I'll redo the whole back of it. You see how nasty it looks in the back, and I'll dip the whole thing in evaporust and then finish the back side of it and get it all coated. I'll use some shark hide, which is a special uh, chrome coating. You can it's like a clear coat you can put over chrome. It's called shark hide. You can get it from Eastwood and a couple other companies, which works really good. And here's the front bumper. You can see it still has some of the rust and pitting in front, but there's that beautiful oil rub bronze on the bolts and then the whole underside of it is oil rub bronze kind of hard to see but all everything I reshot everything and coated it and so the whole back side of it is completely redone and beautiful it's really shiny and looks really really good so so yeah Rusty's coming together one piece at a time and we're getting him going tomorrow. I'm going to get under and check out his transmission, see if I can get reverse working. I've done some research, and I think reverse probably does work. It's just that the um, bushings down below have been worn out, and they're more oval than they are around. So we'll check that out. So anyway, update on Rusty, and we're getting moving, moving him forward. This guy was dipped in evapor rust. You can see how nice and shiny it is now and redone. And so is the so was the bird it was redone. So alrighty. Till next time.